Okay, so let me uh, show you how to use the file view tool of Ankong. So first we need to start the application. And you can see here, if we double click the application, we will get um, something that looks like this. Okay, so uh, first, uh, before we can do any analysis, we need to load in a corpus. So as, as I've explained in the getting started tutorial video, we go to file, open corpus manager, and in here we would look for a corpus that we want to analyze. And I've been using this uh, learned subcorpus of the Amio 6 one million word general English corpus. So we now have that. In previous videos, I explained how to use the quick tool and the plot tool. And these are tools that will let you look at um, words and phrases in the corpus as a whole. And but if sometimes we want to look at individual files and see how words and phrases are used there. Sometimes we want to have a close reading of the target files. So this is where file, the file view tool is important. So if we click on the file view tool and then click on one of the files in the corpus, we get to see what the file looks like. Okay, it's a, you can see here, it's just a plain text file and we, uh, and uh, that's it. Uh, what we can do though with the file view tool is we can um, search within the file for different words and phrases. For example, if I search for the word, we can see here the word paper. So if I search for the word paper, we see there's one hit for the word paper and we can jump to that by clicking on the hit location here. And of course we can search for other um, expressions like paper focuses. And if we were interested in that, again, we can go and search for that and see that in the file. So we can use these search options like word and case. And if you want to do regular expression searches, you can choose the regex option and search for words that way. And uh, basically that's the, the, the core functionality of file view. Now, this tool is actually used with other tools a lot. So in the quick tool, if you click on a quick concordance line, it will jump to the file view to show you the, the word in context. And similarly, if you click on one of the plot lines in the plot tool, it will jump to the file view to show you those um, words in context. How do you save the results? Well, as with other tools, if you go to file and save current tab results, then you'll, a window will open up and here you can choose to uh, save the information. For example, this would be file view results, and we can save those. And then if we go to the folder where we save those files uh, here, uh, file view results, we'll see just a plain text version of those files. So a very simple tool, um, but also a very useful tool when you want to look at the text in your corpus. Uh, so uh, try out the file view tool.